Hey, this is Brad, and today I want to talk about the SECURE Act 2.0 and what does that mean for federal employees, federal retirees. Uh, when it comes to retirement planning, comes to taxes, there's a lot of changes that happen, right? Okay, Con Congress passes new legislation, it affects our retirement. So, what does SECURE Act 2.0, um, what's in it for federal employees, federal retirees? Well, a couple pretty good things, okay? Number one, RMDs, okay? You are not, if you turn uh, if you turn 72 this year, you don't have to take an RMD, okay? No RMDs until age 73 now, all right? And then I, and then I believe that age goes like 75 here in 10 years, but that's in 10 years. We're not really worried about that right now, but RMDs, no required minimum distributions until age 73 now. If you're already taking RMDs, yes, you have to continue taking them. But if you haven't turned 72 yet, no RMD until age 73, okay? Now, also related RMDs, Roth TSP. So one of the inconveniences of Roth TSP has been that you're still forced to take distributions at age 72, just like you are traditional TSP. However, with the Roth IRA, you're not forced to do that. So in the past, what people needed to do was move money out of TSP into a Roth IRA to avoid those RMDs, but no longer the case. So now there are no longer forced RMDs from Roth TSP, all right? So that's a plus. Uh, number three, and this is a big plus as well, it's probably going to affect it a small percentage of federal employees, but special category employees like law enforcement, air traffic controllers, people like that. Uh, once you have 25 years of service in now, you retire, you have immediate access to your TSP without penalty, okay? So remember, it just changed here a few years back to where if you're special category, you retire, then you get access to your TSP at age 50. Now, if you have 25 years in, access to TSP with no penalty, okay? This is a big deal for those that may start at like age 22 with the government, um, you know, start with ICE, Homeland Security, um, whoever it may be. You get 25 years in, now at age 47, you can retire and you have access to your TSP immediately. Where previously, if you retire at 47, you had to wait until 59 and a half to get access to it. So, huge plus for special category employees included in the SECURE Act. You now have access to your TSP if you retire with 25 years in. Okay, that's it for now. A um, lot of other changes in SECURE Act 2.0, but these are the three biggest ones that are affecting federal employees and federal retirees.